this is Nigeria. You can't compare them with abroad. But you have to understand. In, in my own case, you know, I was in the army for a long time with when I got married to my late husband. No. So looking uh, side by side, no sickness, nothing. Then one day you will see that you yeah, are probably in bed in the night. You see people surround the whole uh, government house to come and kidnap. You know, from that kidnap, the, no more. So you must realize that is a very difficult uh, thing to think about it. You know, but we put everything in prayer. I didn't know that things like that can ever happen. And I saw it, I witnessed it. Can we, what can you do? You take it. In fact, I was in Abuja, uh, Bukhari, the head of state, called me to Abuja. And uh, we discussed at length. Really, is uh, is uh, is very difficult to talk about uh, things you see in Nigeria. People like me, they say we are diplomats. We don't talk much, you know, but. I know, I believe in, in anything that anybody who is with God is with the majority. You know, especially somebody like me, who was trained by the Reverend Sisters, the Covet at Okibe, you know. So I, the things happened, and uh, I was full of surprise. If you can tell, but then uh, somebody who knows God, you know, who believe in God and who understand the language, you know, of religion. That helps a great deal. That's a great deal. And then you realize that people are different. You know? People are different. So it's, it's not a good it's not a very good experience for any young girl to come and witness but what can you do? So many children. See, yeah, I have no. Mm -hmm. What can you do? So many children. See, yeah, I have no. All right, ma'am. Mm -hmm. um, before I let you go, uh, what uh, are your suggestions? What are your views about uh, the way forward for Nigeria as a whole? And to the ruling uh, to the presidency and those in power, even uh, extended uh, to the state government um, when it comes to leadership. Mm -hmm. yeah, when it comes to leadership, it is it, like uh, what is going on at Owere. You know, when I, I saw what uh, is going to happen because uh, at Owere, uh, the, the, the wife of the governor of where uh, is my girl, you know, she's a friend to my children. And, but I, I did tell them to take it easy. You know, the way they're going, I don't think that's the way to do it. Uh -huh. But when you advise them like that, it will, they will never take it unless when the thing goes bad. They will not believe that uh, what he told them will eventually happen. And when it happened, then what do you say? You said, well, it's, uh, it's good when you are doing something. You remember that uh, God created you and created another person. 
and they all have different attitude to life. That is what what is uh, what in Nigeria. See, when when uh, somebody like me who has lived all over the world, a few places I have not seen. Well, you cannot come to Nigeria. You say that uh, the what he experienced when we were in London that uh, is anything to come up uh, mission. When you are in Nigeria here, we have different attitude. We have different uh, ways of dealing with our problems. See, but what can you do? That is what it is. See, I, most, I, I don't like uh, interview very much, but all the interview that I have made, that people have come to me. I have told them what is the way to do things, you know, the way to do things, not the way the people are doing it now, it's not, it's not advisable, it's not, see, but, um, uh, and I think uh, the only thing is, uh, when they take over, they promise heaven and they will do this, they will do that, they will do that. When they come, they are chasing money, chasing everything. We will not allow them to concentrate on what they are doing. That's why we, every year we will not go forward, we will not go back first. But we continue to pray to God. He is the Alpha, He is the Omega, He is the one that will change us. Then when he get fed up with us, he, he said, okay, he turned his back to us. Then that's the end. But he's a merciful God. So he will be giving us a long rope to change. And I hope they will change. No, no, not all this, when you, go, go get the, you have made a governor to come and look after his state. All oh, the pensioners are dying. They are not, they are not giving them their, their hard earned money. You know? So you see people going from one place to the other, bury. Why? Because their salaries are not paid to them. Is, is, that is, is it less. Um, Unless Nigeria changes some of their patterns, it will be very difficult. So that we will be dilly dally. Every month we dilly dally. Continue to pray to God. Is God going to come down from heaven? No. We use, we use some people. The problem is after using them, do they actually say yes? It is is the is God who did it, not not their own handwork did it. So that, that's that's the, the, the that's the fact about the whole case. But we still believe that um, he's a merciful God. We continue to be begging him, and uh, I think he, he listens to us. But the people that are killing us are. Ah, people who are looking after us, our, our, our top leaders, as they call them. That is what it is.